Hi, I just thought I'd show you in the light of a few conversations I've had with other therapists, how I set up my treatment room in light of the current guidelines we have around the coronavirus. So I'm a reflexologist and a Bowen therapist. So I have a Lefuma, um chair for my reflexologist, re reflexology clients. And I also have a, a treatment crouch for my Boeing clients. So I thought I'd show you how I set things up. So we'll start with the Lefuma because actually what I do on the Lefuma, I also do on the couch. So it doesn't matter which one we start with. My Lefuma has a um, fabric cover. So what I've done is I've invested in this um, waterproof cover. It's just a single waterproof mattress protector that I bought online. And that just slips really nicely over the whole of the Lefuma and once it's covered with a sheet, my clients can't tell that it's there. They certainly don't notice it. They certainly haven't told me. Obviously, my couch has got a, a plastic cover, so I don't need to pop any additional protection on there. And then for both of them, what I use are these lightweight cotton sheets. Now, I got these from Sainsbury's, but you can buy them from anywhere. Um, again, single bed cover. And these fit really nicely over the, the Lefuma. And if you have a treatment couch, the beauty about these single bed sheets is they don't rock up when clients roll over. Um, I know with some of the more fitted ones, they can rock up, but these, these don't. So I use these on my Lefuma here and on my treatment couch. Um, obviously, blankets is the next thing. I provide blankets. I just feel it's better for me to provide the blankets. And I've just invested in these very lightweight, um, again, single bed size fleeces. These ones are from Dunnell Mill and I think they were six pounds. So not an expensive investment. And what I've done is I've bought four sets. So I've got enough, you know, four clients is really for me at the moment enough per day. It gives me enough time to have a break in between. So a nice comfy blanket. And then pillows, if you use them. I do on my Lefuma. I don't tend to use them on my treatment couch. Um, normal pillows and I've just bought waterproof covers for them. In terms of my reflexology clients, I use two. So I have a nice soft pillow for their heads. And again, this is just a normal lightweight pillowcase. And I'd normally cover this with a pillowcase. This is to go underneath their legs. Um, so that's the second one. And that's the memory foam one. Apologies to the creases. These have all been with my cupboard for the last three or four months. Um, and then in terms, uh, again, this is probably quite specific to um, reflexologists. I've always used muslin cloths, uh, you know, even prior to the pandemic. So I use one of these uh, for the client's feet and that's enough to wrap, keep one foot warm while you're working on the other one. I also have one of these on my lap. Um, just in case I need to itch my face, then I can just pick it up and itch my face with it rather than using my hands, which just have oil on them. And again, I've, I've always done that. And then finally, I use these big swaddling cloths. And again, I've just bought these online, but you can buy them from anywhere. And this goes over that bottom pillow just as a, an added layer of protection for any oils or waxes that I'm, um, that I'm using. So there you have it. That's how I set up my Lefuma. And I set up my treatment couch in exactly the same way in terms of the cotton bed sheet um, and the, the fleece blanket if I need it and, and pillows if I need it. Um, in terms of cleaning, uh, I use this product here. It's called Dew. This was recommended to me by an infection control nurse and it's something that, that she used in, in her hospital wards. It is um, electrolyzed water, so you can use it straight on plastic and it won't do it any damage. This one doubles up as a hand sanitizer and a, and a surface cleaner. So it's perfect and it's not very expensive at all. So I really, I really do recommend that. And it's, um, it kills 99.995% of bacteria, viruses, fungi and spores. So that's a really good investment. And again, I have a set, another set of these smaller muslin cloths that I use to wipe down surfaces um, just to really save on any waste in, in, in the treatment room really more than anything. Um, and that's it. You can set up your treatment room how you want to. You haven't got to use these things. Um, you can, lots of therapists just do uh, bare plastic covers and use couch roll, and that's absolutely fine. The point of showing you this was just to show you that you can use linens if you want to. Obviously, I wash, um, I strip the beds and clean them after each client, and I have a laundry basket in my room that's covered with a lid. Um, but yeah, that's kind of it, really. Hope that was useful. Take care. Bye.